A Solana Beach woman charged with murdering her stepfather took the witness stand late today, testifying in her own defense. Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Carlo Chiquetto. I'm Marcella Lee. Prosecutors say Jade Jenks killed her stepfather after finding naked photos of herself on his computer. CBS 8's David Godfordson is at the Vista Courthouse, where testimony just ended for the day. You know, he'll call me one day say, let's do dinner on Tuesday next week. Jade Jenks testified she used to have a loving relationship with her stepfather, Tom Merriman, when she was in her 20s. But then they drifted apart. Then, in 2020, she moved in next door to him on Nardo Avenue in Solana Beach. I've always been a caretaker for Mr. Merriman, so... Okay. What does that mean? Um, anytime something would go wrong, uh, when we lived together before and then after I moved there, um, if he hurt himself, I'd go get bandages. If he was sick, I'd go get soup. Um, if he needed a ride to the doctor, I took him. Under questioning by her defense attorney, she testified Merriman took a number of medications, including sleeping pills. Did you share medication? I have, yes. When I say share medication, I mean with uh, Mr. Merriman. Yes. Um, most of the time it was, you know, he'd ask me um, for a medication or I'd tell him to try something. Uh, yeah, I did. Okay. Uh, did you ever use any of his medications? No. In late December, prosecutors allege Jenks was cleaning up her stepfather's house and found naked photos of herself on his computer. Prosecutors showed the jury a series of text messages between Jade and a friend. In one message on the morning of New Year's Eve, Jenks allegedly texted the friend, quote, I just dosed the hell out of him. Deputies found Merriman's body under a pile of trash next to the garage on January 2nd, 2021. An autopsy found he died from acute intoxication from sleeping pills. On the witness stand, Jenks claimed she had seen Merriman intoxicated in the past. I just, I couldn't understand anything he was saying. There was no conversation. He couldn't hear me. I, so I told him when he'd sobered up, you know, just not to come over that messed up because there's no point. Now, Jenks only took the witness stand late this afternoon. She has not testified about finding those naked pictures of herself on her stepfather's computer. And importantly, she has not gone through any cross-examination from the prosecution. All the questioning today was by her attorney, so her testimony will continue tomorrow. So there's still a ways to go here, David. How, how much longer is this trial expected to last? Well, we are told closing arguments are expected next week, so it should wrap up sometime next week. Compelling case. David Goffertson reporting live. Thanks, David.